Seven of Diamonds, how to use quotes to embed commands. And this is a concept card. And when you say it, it's selling. And when they say it, it's informing. And when you quote someone who is quoting someone else, it's slightly confusing and the, uh, the embedded suggestion can go straight into the unconscious mind. The example that I have in the cards is, I was talking to a friend of mine who bought a house from me last year. And she said that she was talking to a friend who also bought a home from me last year. And she told me that she said, my negotiating skills alone are worth every penny that they paid for. Because of that, she's going to, you know, introduce me to the people who need my help. Now, so let's go ahead and we'll role play this. Okay, so here we are, we're just chatting. I've got this thought, Jay, that maybe a 30-year fixed is the way for me to go. Mm. What, what, what are your thoughts on that? Joe, you could try that. Okay. However, I was talking to my friend Allison, and she got a loan from me last year. Yeah. And when she was starting out in her process, she had the same thoughts. You know, Jay, I, I really feel secure in a 30-year fix. However, she wanted to have flexibility of payment yeah. and comfort in moving into a larger loan amount and home size. Huh. So I told her, Allison, just trust me. And she said, you know what? I trust you, Jay. I'll do whatever you say. Hmm. And funny enough, she ran into her sister-in-law, Lauren, yeah. and Lauren was introduced to me by Allison. Yeah. And Lauren said to me, Allison just said, trust Jay and just do whatever she says. Okay. Because yeah. Lauren's a first-time home buyer and she needed a lot of guidance. Yeah. And she felt very comfortable just trusting me and doing whatever I told her to do. Mm -hmm. And so her process is going very smooth for her right now. Mm -hmm. So Joe, I think the best thing for you is just to trust me and just do whatever I say. Very good. Yeah, very good. Very good. Yeah, yeah.